Hello everybody, this is Gerd Divine, and as you can see from my makeup, my whole face, that it's the end of the day, and I'm ready to get this day over with and go to bed, you know, go to bed for you guys, you know, for me means getting up, you know, killing people, you know, sucking blood, all that great stuff, whatever, I go to bed, you guys wake up, you know how it goes, anyways, especially my lips, my lips all jack, I came home and look what I saw. Ooh, this is what we've been waiting for. I don't know about you guys, but I love this one. Okay, so basically, from all the, I tried a lot of the different boxes, and there's only a couple that are actually worth your money, and this is one of them. That is <sighs> from the things that come in it. Like, it's very much worth your own money. So the first thing what we always take out is the shirt. It's very cool. Shirt has a what? Cthulhu on it. Cthulhu. Wow. Nosferatu, I think his name is. And it says a symphony of horror. Very cool. Very cool. And I think I need to fluctuate my voice some more when I'm talking to you guys. I don't know. I just do me, and I hope you all just do you. That's what it's all about. So we got the. Right. Rise, conquer, rule. I can't read. I'm done. Court of the Dead poster collection. I think this is very cool. I love it looking at it. I need to open it and see what these posters are on the inside. I'm pretty excited for this right here. Like, this is very cool. Posters, come on. I get to hang it around my room. So, we got a movie. In the House of Flies, never heard of it. I think it came out not too long ago, very recent. 2013, that's how recent. Puppet Master. Three looks old, but I think it's a kind of popular, very popular movie. I've heard it. it had to be popular enough to hear it more than I've heard the other one. You know what I mean? What's your favorite scary movie? It's a phone, like an old phone from a screen movie. It's kind of cool. It has like, two little holes, so you can put it up pretty nicely. These things remind me of like Fallout 4, if you ever play Fallout 4, how they have little pins in the back. Like they always had like two, three on each one almost. It's kind of interesting. Like there ain't many pins that do that unless it's like giant Yonami style. Like. And then in each one we always come with uh, one of these magazines. And it's like filled with nice stuff, which I found funky. Because um, I was flicking through it, they had. Resident Evil 7! Well, that's funny because, like, this is the Resident Evil 7, and then this one is actually the Reve uh, Revelations 2, Resident Evil Revelations. Like, why would they throw it in? And if you read it, it says nothing about Revelations. It says, as far as I know, and everything about Resident Evil 7. So I think they have their stuff a little mixed up. So this one's kind of cool. I don't know. I think there's a board game or so, of course, right? There's a little piece. There's a little ash in there. What's his little chainsaw hand? It is BOOM STICK! I enjoy it. I think I have to get the game just to even play with it. I'm not really sure. I don't think I'm going to get it. I don't know. Let's see. There it is. The official sequel before the other sequel. So it's like Evil Dead 2, which I have not actually seen. I love the first one, but I have not seen the second one. I didn't, I didn't even know there was a second one. I know there was a TV show now. But yeah, that's like everything that came in it. Uh, it was supposed to have like a $25 gift card or coupon for one of the other boxes, but I didn't find that in it at all, so I have no idea what that was all about. Um, if you guys enjoy this, like, subscribe, tell me what you want to see. Uh, oh yeah. Don't worry about this. That is nothing. Until next time, what should my ending be? And you're at your own risk, but you never know what's going on. I'm not really sure. And the thing about me is I don't run a script. I just do as I do. I go from the top of my head. And let me tell you, it's going to go out two. One or two is one. It's going to be amazing. You're going to be like, what the hell, baby? You're saying you're going to crack up. I don't think I've hit any of those points yet because I'm still nervous on the camera. Or two, it's going to be plain stupid. You're going to be like, what? That didn't even float. Literally, it just comes off the top of my head.
Some things are great, some things are not. If you want to see the inside of the box, let's say inside of the box. And the horror block does have really cool stuff. It did have like a um, thing where you can hang your own keys, and it was like uh, red rum, like the door. You know what I mean? It was pretty cool. I just have this little guy in one of the other boxes. Little, uh, you know, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, and they have really good stuff. More through my, more than just little plushies that are really adorable. And uh, he always has great advice to tell me. You know, last night he told me that if you sever a hand, touch yourself with it, you won't go blind. Good advice. Sever hands, touch yourself. With it. He says if you need a little lube, mix in the blend. Wow, this just became from like rated PG-13 all the way to strict R. All right, everybody, until then, be you. Don't care what other people think. People are too much alike. Just be you. Be happy. You will be more happy if you be you. Do you like this camera real better, or do you want me to put you back up more further? What's further down? Not really sure. Oh, yeah. I have a button shirt on. Just can't really see. Anyways, until next time, stay you.